There's a lot of ships out here. Control the Oracle! Impossible! Apollo would not allow that! Now they're looking for my mother. Oh, okay. I think I understand. I believe they will hurt others who oppose their views along the way. By Hermes! The Oracle lost to corruption, and now this cult? Do we know who needs them? I don't know for sure. Why, Zeus, your life is complicated. Tell me about it. Oh, but don't you worry. we have to board it. This cult of Cosmos now has three new enemies. I thought we just one shot it, but we still have to do the thing. We'll bring the wrath of the gods down upon them. Always. That's why I like him. Poseidon, carry us to Athens. First, we need to go to Athens. Easy fucking game. Man, this bow is actually pretty good, huh? What do you mean? Ship upgrades. You couldn't have said this before. Yes. We can't sail. <laughs> I know about Thank ship you upgrades. I don't name are we going to get the supplies? My father taught me that the sea takes to do. and we Maybe. must do the same. Fortunately, there are plenty of pirate ships in these waters that we can board and take from. What are we waiting for? Let's hunt some pirates. Now that we have the necessary Wait, is that... resources, we can upgrade the ship's hull. The sign will be raised. Hull, yeah. What? Like a feast in the ocean. I can't upgrade the ship's hull. I'm pretty sure I don't have enough resources, right? No, I don't have enough wood by a long shot. What is this hull, yeah quest? Bonus wanted to teach Cassandra how to upgrade the ship's hull in order to take on bigger and tougher opponents. Well, like, I've already done that game. <laughs> Do you not have a way of telling that I've already done? Oh, quest completed. Oh, it immediately auto-completes itself. Okay, that's good. They did think of that. They did think of that. I'm impressed. Very good. Should we have a fucking go? Whoa! What the hell? What was that? That was amazing! Oh my god! That looked so sick! Hello, you bitches! This is cool. I can just fucking sit back here and annihilate. Okay. Maybe I should go and help. <laughs> Maybe. Hello! This is fun. I really like ship combat. I really, really enjoy the ship combat. I wonder how much imp no, I want to take command. I wonder how much improved it is over um over Black Flag because I know everyone loved it in Black Flag. Okay, I guess we're ramming this one then. Oh, you're a big boy, huh? Okay. Let's take out your small boy friends first. Ow, my health. Jesus, there's a lot of people there. Okay. Let's just fucking go in then, shall we? Some of that. little bit of this. Oh my god, I can actually just... Hey! <laughs> there he goes. <laughs> Wanker! Love that. This is great. This is great. I would appreciate it if he actually, like, died. Oh, I think he just did. Never mind. Haha. <laughs> Who's next? Let's go! 
No, that was not what I wanted. Come on, you could get it. There we go. Lovely. I've already forgotten how it said to uh, use the fire stuff. <laughs> Oh well. It's going fine. Lovely. No, I didn't. I want to jump over. <laughs> Night. I am just absolutely murking. All of these ships. This is amazing. <laughs> ship combat has never felt so good. I mean, I wouldn't know because I've never played another ship combat game, but... It is feeling very, very satisfying. Hello! You're mine, motherfuckers. This is this is amazing. This is I'm just rinsing them. Oh, hang on. Okay, that was almost terrible. I uh, <laughs> had forgotten to plug my laptop in when I started recording, but thankfully, we're all good. This move is actually the greatest thing. How are you still on this fucking place? Get off the edge. Easy. Easy. This is a great way to farm fucking wood, apparently. <laughs> Just all the wood. I wonder how uh, many ships end up spawning. Like, Seems like we've killed quite a lot so far. I really need to remember how to use these uh, fire things. Let me have a look. Left trigger and RB or right bumper for fire javelins. Okay. Left trigger and RB. Oh. Hello. We're at maximum speed. Fire arrows. Try again. What's going on? Oh, yes. Oh my god, that looks so incredibly sick. That looks so incredibly sick, I can't even deal with it. Man, okay. We'll stop soon. But this is so much fun. This is truly amazing. Hello. Ow. Maybe don't combo me into the ground. You bitches. Damn it. My move did not work. I could not kick him off the edge. Kill three enemies without being hit 20 times. That was the first time I've ever managed that. That is slightly worrying. <laughs> oh, hey, that's actually better. We've actually got gear that is better. What a shocker. You're worse. You're worse. You're worse. You... That is decently better. Sure. Get rid of all of you. And I've got a new weapon. Uh, you're worse. Worsey worse. Oh my god, that has a lot of good shit on it, but no.
much to do. My god. This is amazing. This is... <laughs> I should just... I should just do this all the time. <laughs> okay, no, right. Main quest. Main quest. Speed up! Increase speed! Blaze on! We are going for it, finally. <laughs> Sorry about that. I mean, I hope you enjoy watching some of that shit. I just find that incredibly fun. And I mean, let's be honest, it was pretty fucking easy, so. Okay, so it seems like if you actually seems like if you don't let go in time of the rowing thing, then you can't raise the sails. But if you do let go just before it runs out and raise the sails, you get a pretty quick boost. I mean, it's still a fair old distance. I like the, li I like the little sea shanties they've got going. This is quite the long journey. New location, the Sunken Temple of Aphrodite. I guess I'd have to dock somewhere and swim down to it again. I'm not gonna lie, I'm laser focused right now. I want to see what this place is. So I'm going to ignore that, but good to know that it exists, I suppose. Bit of loot coming up here. Don't mind if I do. Thank you very much. Chalkis City. You know, the battle where a handful of Athenians push back the first Persian invasion. Hello, dolphins. King Darius of Persia. I'm not sure. A site where the great Viseos slayed the vicious great bull. Oh, that was hard. You're both hopeless. We. You want to go? You want to go, son? Everyone, to battle positions! Get them! A miss! Prepare for every fire! Arrows, cover for them! We're ready to lose! We missed them! Have some of that, mate. You think you're as good as me? At ship combat, you fucking moron. You can never be me. Oh god, that is a lot of fire though. Perfect opportunity. Get off the... Oh, that didn't actually kill him. I wanted to knock him off. <laughs> Lovely stuff. Who's left? Just you. Get off the edge, mate. You're done. Athenian tassels, very nice. Love me some tassels. Oh, and a waistband. Which of these is better? <laughs> 95, 105. Oh, wait. 101. I'd just rather take the fucking straight upgrade, to be honest. More hunter damage. I don't use hunter that much. Crit when full health. I'm not full health that much. It's whatever. Okay, back to it. Hopefully they won't fuck with me now, right? Right? You're not going to fuck with me? You're just going to let me leave? Yes? Good. 
I mean, they totally are, they're trying. They're trying their best, but I think we can outrun them, to be honest. Ready yours. Let's get that pace up. Bye. Oh, there's a side quest over there. I want it so badly. No, must laser focus. I want to get this main quest done today. And I don't have too long left. Because it is quite late in the evening. I haven't packed for my holiday tomorrow yet. I haven't had dinner yet. I need to render and upload today's videos. The two I'm recording now. So there's still quite a lot to do. And it's 10 p.m. I would also like to know this. It is. It's fucking amazing in battle. I just realized as I held Y there that it let me leave command, which might let me dive down onto those sunken temple bits, which would be very helpful. Man, they love their sea shanties, don't they? <laughs> very nice. Okay, there's a lot of Here it is. a lot of dudes. <laughs> oh wait, no, they're boars. Oh fuck them! You're mine, boars. Uh, would the no the assassinate thing wouldn't be more useful here? I don't think. Oh wait, is it a legendary? Maybe. Oh, I think it's the gold the gold question mark thing. That means it's a legendary, right? Where is it? Up there? Oh no, it's in there. Okay. Guessing it's not going to be so easy as just open the door and Is let me in. A door? How do I get inside? I wonder if Or potentially the spear will help. <laughs> Come on, you can do it, white cutscene of loading this. Hesitation only hastens. The grave, I know, Mater. Your form is improving. Your resolve is strong. But you're not taking action. I was going to. I know. But it's the moments in between that decide everything. Your turn. Why, thank you. Leonida's spear. You're old enough now. My father's spear holds a certain burden, but you're ready. something. Huh? The spear. It has magic. Carries with it a long line of power. A bloodline. Of I was expecting her mum to go, fuck off. No, it doesn't. <laughs> She's like, yeah. <laughs> power. Family. All of us? Think of Leonidas. He had great courage. And he made a great sacrifice. You share his blood and the strength he possessed. We are able to Feel certain things happening around us. That is our family's gift. But not 
everyone understands that. Some recognize the power we bear and want it only for themselves. They will try to take it from us. I won't let them. Man, has every Assassin's Creed... I don't remember two having cutscenes anywhere near as interesting as these. If we keep moving I wonder what... Probably last forward. game, maybe? Yeah, Did they add proper cutscenes like this? Because this is so good. I'm so taken now. in by the story. <laughs> I'm so enraptured. So, hopefully, the spear will just let us open the door. <laughs> Please? Mother, Please? I haven't forgotten you. Yes? Oh, yes. I was expecting a keyhole, but no, just fucking wave it about near the door and that's all it takes. Lovely stuff. In we go, then. Legendary beast inside, I believe. I think that's what the golden question marks mean. Ancient Forge. Okay, now that is interesting. Icarus is not available. It definitely said that the golden question mark was down here. Or maybe maybe golden question mark is something How to do with the like gods rather than necessarily beasts because this would be god stuff. I should probably be scaling. How could I even explain this to someone like Marcos? Like, it looks like there's a space up there. Although, it doesn't seem like she can climb it. Never mind. No, she totally can't. Okay. What are we going to find up Something's here? Over there. Yeah, it sure is. Oh, is it a fully rebuilt spear? Hello. Oh, hot diggity dayum. It's going to rebuild the full spear, isn't it? I can feel it. I can feel that it will. Aletheia. Oh my god, this is awesome. What's an Aletheia when it's at home? And do we really need a full loading screen for whatever this AI thing is doing? Apparently we do. Apparently this is required. Come on game, I have faith in you. There we go. Oh, we're back in the modern day. Fuck off. Not gonna lie. Not that interested. <laughs> I knew I let you stand the animus too long. Your vitals are crashing. You don't understand. This confirms it. Cassandra didn't just have Isu technology. She had the means to improve it. Imagine how powerful the staff could be. I admit, that could be an incredible find. But right now, I'm the doctor, and I take care of you. Now get some rest before you go back to Cassandra. Feels like they're telling the player to take a rest, but I've only been going an hour, so fuck off. No time to rest. Abstergo goons could be tracking us down right now. And the rest of us will be ready for them. If you burn out here, our mission will be done. They told me you had a cheerful bedside manner. Don't forget, we're a team. We'll back you up until you're finished your investigation. I know. Kyoshi secured the loft yesterday and he's keeping an eye out. Elena's on call doing historical research. I'm not gonna lie, folks. To talk if you're feeling any confusion I couldn't animus. give a single Always toss about these two. So, Doctor, how do you feel now that we're closer than ever to the staff? I believe this staff is important. But the Templars and Assassins have found staves of Eden before. Nikolai Tesla blew one up in Russia, if I remember correctly. This is different. If what I saw in Egypt is true, this staff doesn't control minds. It controls physics. Time. Imagine rewriting the rules of the universe. The spear you found is right here, and it's not doing anything. The spear is attached to a bloodline. Leonidas, Cassandra, and Themos, 
I mean, Alexios. They were intimately connected to it. Are you sure you can use the staff of Hermes, then? No. But if the Templars get it, they won't stop until they find someone who can. Hmm. So, what do you think of my new Animus? You mean, our new Animus? That's Abstergo equipment. Which I've modified to within a millimeter of its digital life. It's an Animus console prototype, Brahman variant, with the IO capacities pushed to their max. Ultra portable with more calculating power than NASA okay. and CERN combined. Okay. I'll go stretch my legs. Too bad we don't have access to the Abstergo gym anymore, huh? Membership costs too much. No, don't make me stretch my legs. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's have a look then, shall we? At random shit. Fascinating. Layla, can you believe we're meeting Herodotus himself? I can. He sure does talk a lot. Is there anything Who is Herodotus like? to these people? So does what I'm seeing as Cassandra match your research? I had to tweak the animus to use what we have of the book as reference. That book is a lost work by Herodotus. Oh. He basically invented the Okay, I didn't realize that. And other figures are matching up That's too. cool. Cleon, Pericles. The chance to see the past firsthand is why I joined the Assassins. Most people would talk about justice or leaping across rooftops, but history's cool too. I've loved history since my grandpa told me stories about his grandpa back in Ireland. He was an adventurer and sailor, so I'm continuing the family tradition. I feel so lucky. You make your own luck, remember? Why do people keep telling me that? And what do you know so about I've him? I've met Irodotos, but I don't know much about him. He's brilliant. His histories are considered the foremost textbook of classical Greece. People have made their careers analyzing his words for some new perspective. To see him in his own world, walking in the polis, and... Sorry, but he's kind of a hero of mine. You can fangirl all you want. Yay! Hooray. <laughs> I'll leave you to your work. If you need anything, just let me know. What else have we got? Over here, a different laptop. The Quebec Caper. Oh, Christ. I'm just going to click all these in case it gets me an achievement for reading them all, but I definitely, definitely don't give a fuck. Reality is a simulation. I mean... Miracles... Ah, Does anyone give a fuck about any of this? I truly don't. Mission candidate Harlan Cunningham. Hmm. That seemed a bit more important. Oh no, this is the team that we got together. There's Alana that we were just talking to. He looks cool. And that's the doctor packing for Greece. Animus shit. Looking up for history. Herodotus. The spear. Who is Aletheia? Okay, this is more interesting. So, the Isu, aka Precursors, or those who came before, they're humanoid and they're ancient. They have triple helix DNA and six primary senses. The Isu say they created Homo sapiens to serve them, and who knows if they're wrong. Abstergo classifies them as Homo sapiens divinus, though they waffle on on whether they're gods or not. Sometimes individual Isu say they aren't, but usually they act like they are. They like to give themselves god names anyway. Wait, weren't the ancient gods named after them? It's a sort of chicken and egg situation. We know that the Isu had other names before they took the ones we know. Like, Juno was also called Uni. Was? Did Juno die or something? I really need to fucking YouTube what happened in this storyline. And just to check, Aletheia is not a goddess name, is it? You got it, boss. It literally means truth. But if you ask Heidegger, well, not literally, he's dead. It means the disclosure of truth. You dedicated huge chunks of philosophy to defining exactly what that meant. What's the short version? Aletheia is unconcealedness, as opposed to correspondence, which is truth as accurate definitions of reality, or coherence, which is truth as statements that are consistent with the rest of reality. Okay, I think I'll leave the philosophy to you while I handle tech. Deal? Eh, works for me. <laughs> so the next thing to realise is that there's Isu, and then there's Isu. The main movers and shakers are, well, were, the Capitoline Triad. 
Jupiter, Minerva, and Juno. Or was it Minerva? I, rem I remember vaguely. I think this picture right here might have been from one of the early Assassin's Creed games. I remember we did see them at some point. I can't remember what. I was trying to follow it for a while on YouTube. Uh, and one of them was evil and one of them like broke through or something. Those three were scientists who formed a team to save the world from being destroyed by a solar flare. They were like superheroes with ulterior motives. Jupiter and Minerva appeared to sympathise with humans, but really only seemed to make a move after the Toba catastrophe nearly snuffed us out. Juno was in it for the Isu, but mostly for herself. One of those world-saving solutions was the eye that killed Desmond, wasn't it? Exactly. It works short term, but long term seems more iffy. If iffy is a word you can use when you're talking about the end of the world as we know it. Alethea did seem to imply that reality was shifting, or that multiple realities were shifting as calculations were made. I thought you were leaving me the philosophy. Okay, this shit is actually interesting. Juno. So the one so one of the most powerful Isu was Juno. She raised an army of followers trying to help her and her husband Ita get bodies. She wanted to move out of the grey, or a virtual existence in some kind of spiritual tech hybrid afterlife. And the Phoenix Project was going to do just that. The plan was so dangerous that neither the Assassins nor Templars could take it on alone, so we teamed up for a while. Layla, I heard about your colleague Charlotte de la Cruz. I'm sorry, so am I. Weird question. So I know Mr. Berg used some special explosive to make sure there wasn't any DNA left. I'm totally lost at this point. What the fuck's going on here? Well, wouldn't there be some trace of Koei Noor? I mean, you'd think some shards of such powerful artifact would have survived. Alana, when Berg blows something up, he blows it up with extreme prejudice. That site is sterilized. So, another weird question. How did Kyoshi, Galena, and Aren get away then? Too soon, Alana, too soon. I have no idea what most of this is talking about. Phoenix Project or any of this. Hermes. We don't know much about this Isu except that he was one. The Greeks and the Egyptians both worshipped him. His special followers called themselves Hermeticists. The god Hermes was all about magic and alchemy and his staff is the inspiration for the Caduceus. In theory, he met Pythagoras and gave him his staff. We're betting a lot on that theory. We've extrapolated the staff as the key to the Isu equations of reality theory. Based on the information we got in Egypt, the Isu are convinced that understanding the mathematical rules of the universe is the basis to changing it. Are you convinced? I'm convinced it might be true, and that's enough to make that staff very powerful and very, very dangerous. And finally, Alethea. So who is Alethea? She, that's a guess, I didn't record her using any pronouns, called herself that. She has a grudge against the rest of the Isu for their godlier-than-thou attitude. The Isu unified, sh unified front showed cracks before, like that time Minerva and Juno argued in front of Desmond, or when Consus reached through time to contact the assassins behind Juno's back. Huh, I've never heard of Consus. But this is a new level of insubordination. Fortunately for us, Alethea seems to be on humanity's side. Yeah, she reminds me of a Martin Luther nailing his 95 thesis to a church door. Maybe this is the start of the Great Isu Schism. You've got a knack for naming things, you know that? Thanks, boss. Besides, she's a hacker. I like her. Hacking? Is that what she was doing to the retransmissions? Sorry, I realise that's more my department than yours. You heard that v the voice change, right? That's when the retransmission got hacked, replaced right under the other Isu's metaphorical nose. How do you think she did it? Good question. If you want to brute force a problem, try all the security protocols until you find one that works, then lock everyone else out so they can't undo your work. Or, if you're analogue, get a stronger transmitter Mexican radio style. Alethea's big advantage is having all the time in the world to find a solution. Like Consus, she seems to be able to see multiple times at once and communi communicate across them. Or multiple realities. I only wish I could do that kind of multitasking. If anyone could, it would be you, boss. Okay, that was quite a lot. What's in the email folder? Fuck me. No. Audio. The last book of Herodotus. Okay, yeah, no, I don't care. The center of the universe, circa 400 BCE. That was interesting. That was interesting, genuinely. I like the god stuff. Eagles are fine and all, but a pet monkey would be even cooler. Anything around here? Man, we're living in quite the hole, hey? What? Oh, why the fuck is there a fucking Rayman rabbit thingy here? I wonder if the Fry Twins would still recognize London. A rooftop's still a rooftop. How's it going out there? Well, no threats in view. I'm glad we could work together again. I believe our working methods are compatible. Are you still upset about our last run-in with Abstergo? I'm sorry, I didn't realize those hills in Quebec were so steep. 
But hey, you and so that's the Corvette thing we saw on the computer, which Sorry. I don't really care about. <laughs> He's ex Yakuza. Cool. I'll take it. He sounds like a bonus on the team. What do you think we should do next then? Of course, I'll return to the Animus, then follow the trail Irodotos left to find the staff. But there's so, so is that our end goal here? Is so finding this choices. staff thing? There's no way to know which ones are right. You used to run part of the Japanese Brotherhood. What would you do? Take things one step at a time, observe their act, or kill everyone and search their pockets for answers. You decide. Thanks for watching our backs, Kiyoshi. I'll leave you to your work. I'll report in if Abstago drops by. Okay. I think that's everything. I feel like I've... Is there anything more here? No. Oh, wait. A little bit more. Third echelon. Or is it fourth? Is that a Splinter Cell reference? I think that's a Splinter Cell thing. I've never actually played a Splinter Cell game. They're Too supposed to be doing to a new one, aren't they? Some more caribou. I'm pretty sure they're supposed to be making a sort of reboot of Splinter Cell. Okay, can we get back in now? Are you sure you want to go back into the Animus right now? I get the impression you'll be there a long time. Yeah, I'm fucking ready. Yes, I'm ready to go back to Cassandra. All right, I'll be watching your back. Bye, see, bye. Wonder how many times that'll happen. This is a weird loading screen. <laughs> I think I preferred the cool looking pyramid thing to the long tunnel of digital data. The never ending tunnel. Yeah, I'm definitely uh, tonight, whilst shit is uh, rendering and uploading, I will use my phone for YouTube. And I will see if I can find a Cliff Notes version of what the, uh, like, ongoing overarching story is. Because I would quite like to know, because I thought Juno was succeeding, but then they spoke about her in the past tense there, which makes it sound like she's dead now. So, I don't know, I mean, dead is relative, I guess, because she was data. She was, like, in a virtual body, so I don't know. Did it fix it? No. Okay, never mind then. So what was the point in that? My spear is stronger now. Spear upgraded. Stand a chance. Hello, Leonidas' spear. Upgrade the spear of Leonidas here at the Forge of Hephaestus using artifact fragments. Upgrading it increases your adrenaline. Hello, and unlocks more powerful abilities. Oh, sick. Collect artifact fragments from defeated members of the Cult of Cosmos. Review the quest menu to track progress towards more spear upgrades. Okay, so I need to fucking give the Cult of Cosmos my big fat dick, is what you're saying there. Okay. Spear level 2. Okay, cool. Plus 6 health gain per adrenaline spent. 6%. Maximum adrenaline segments is now 5, and ability rank now 2. Cool. Next level, plus 7%, section's up to 6, yeah, okay, I get it. So, uh, we don't actually have a point to spend, do we? Oh, hang on, I thought that would unlock these things. Oh, it will, I just need to level up high enough to actually... Wait, what? A ghostly arrow? Oh my god. That's... Oh, pardon me. That's cool. Oh man, the bow stuff could be good. Three full adrenaline segments for one thing. That's slightly insane, surely. My god. Okay, what did we get over here? New shit in the bag. This margin is too small to explain its power. It's modular, which means it fits together with all the other things. Got another mercenary. Fianna the Flint. Fianna the Flint? Okay, and what is this marker over here? It's like slightly nearer than the actual door is, but... Well, the, it... will be happy. It's clear someone was here far before... Oh, hello. What's... This is all like waking up. That's cool. 
The thing on the compass says it's 90 meters, but that's like 95. <laughs> Why is it different? My god, I wish there was a sprint. A sprint would be incredible. Good thing it's got motion sensors to know when to fucking close again. Oh, hello. Okay. I really need to stop recording soon, but, uh, sure. If it goes on much longer, I'll just make it three fucking parts instead. And I will have an extra day of respite when I return. You're not hard to track. Did you come alone? My god, his voice. I'm so glad I chose Cassandra. <laughs> Alexios, you're alive. Don't touch me. <laughs> come on, little brother. You have to tell me everything. What's happened? She's to very excited, considering she knows that he's part of I the cult. Know you. Well, I know you. It doesn't matter. There's more important things to argue about. You're right. Like that stunt you pulled with the artifact. It got my attention. If that's what you wanted. What? The artifact showed the truth. My We're god. And we His voice acting is life. awful. <laughs> yes, it did show the truth. It confirmed what I always knew. You threw me off a fucking mountain. Excuse me? No, I didn't. If that's what you think, Alexios, you must have hit your head on the way down. I've heard this story, and not from a liar like you. And never call me Alexios. Right. Demos. Now him, I don't know. He's a demigod. Worshipped and feared by the cult and all the Greek world. That's not who you are. Sounds like a fantasy to me. Did the cult cook that story up too? I'd watch your fucking mouth, or I'll shut it for you. You didn't when He you seems had the like before, a parody of his own now. character. Like, he Stupid. talks so weirdly. We need to find our mother. I'm not interested in reunion. I just want to know what you think you're doing. Same thing as your cult. Looking for Mirini, our mother. They don't need her. Your cultists think differently. She's their next target. If they ever pursued her, it would be to kill her. But if you don't know where she is, that means she abandoned you too. How sad. Not quite. I had to run. Even if we were abandoned, we survived. We can go back to the way things were if we can find her. The cult has no interest in sentimentality or family. Its only aim is control. I've never found Nikolaus or I killed Nikolaus. Why would... Why would I not tell the truth? I'm not going to lie to him. Well, I have to lie to him, but I'm not going to say I killed him. If it's true they're after us, tell them they'll never find Nikolaus. He's off the map. Trust me, I've searched myself. If I could find you, the other long lost child of Nikolaus, then I can find him. And when I do, he'll wish he was thrown off that mountain. I don't care what you think. I'll find Mirini. Do the right thing. Come with me. What? We could I can't get over this together. fucking voice. You could help me. <laughs> oh, you think friendship is the answer? Running around like lost children looking for dear mother. You're so weak. It's not it's not weakness. It's responsibility, not weakness. I won't abandon the whole family just for spite. Responsibility? Get off your high horse. The cult has a plan. And it won't be interrupted the by the cult likes of has you. a plan. Ho, 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 ho. Taking your own mother isn't enough for them? We're not abductors. We're political. Those who don't stand with us stand against us. And they pay for that mistake. Like me. Like you. I heard you're planning a trip to Athens. When you go, tell Pericles and his elitist scum they're next. The cult let Mirini live. They let Nikolaos live. Why kill them now? Because you live. 
You brought this on her and yourself. The cult is powerful, but they're mortals. I have the blood of gods, so they think you do too. But they'll see how wrong they are. Why? I'm going after the cult, you know. You've seen our numbers. You've seen what I can do. And you still think you stand a chance? Try me. So having guts runs in the family, does it? <laughs> you claim we have the same blood. So let's see what you can do. Not before I hurt you, excuse me? No. No. We can redeem him, potentially. We still found each other, brother. I told you not to touch me. I don't want to attack him. I don't want to sever that connection completely. Walaka, Herodotus won't believe this. I have to tell him what happened. Hmm. Right, let's quickly get back here. Let's see what Herodotus has to say about this whole thing. Fuck off, bear. Now is not the time. And then... We'll be ready to wrap up, finally. <laughs> a solid 20 minutes after I was expecting to. I probably won't make this three parts. It would be three half an hour parts. I normally like to go more like 35 minutes. Well, so we'll just go two 45 too? ones. Was it magnificent? What happened to you? And your spear? Slow down, Irodotos. My spear's stronger now. I can feel it. You were right. There was some kind of artifact there. It showed me a vision. Of me... And my mother. So, the ancient civilization is real. Cassandra, you have no idea the power you possess. All harnessed in Leonidas' spear. That's not everything. Demos followed me here. The cult's already moving, he told me himself. They're going after us. Wonder, my family. We'd surely kids. see if he what came in a massive do? boat. So he must have taken this a tiny little try. rowboat or something. It doesn't matter. We have to get to Athens, to warn Pericles. And we need to find my mother before they do. Then, we go to the Peniques. If Pericles is anywhere, he's there. Cool. Memories awoken, complete. And a cheeky level up. Big 14, I really like that animation for leveling up. That shit looks good. Let's have a look. Abilities. What should we go for? That requires level 16. Ooh. That could be good. Can we upgrade? Ooh. Now that. Yes. That is very nice indeed. Sorry, the next one requires spear level 5. Four. Man, there's a lot of shit we can upgrade actually now. This is cool. This is very cool. There's also this stuff, but meh. Right. So, that's it for today. We actually got a decent amount of main quest completed. I'm very... My god, there's so many quests now. Jesus. Okay. I think... I don't actually know which one is the main quest at this point. Upgrade the spear. Collect fragments. Okay, so that... So this... The Spear of Leonidas quest is just to do the... Uh, <laughs> do the Eyes of Cosmos quest. Okay, well when we come back, we will be heading to Athens. Uh, it is a level above us, however. So maybe we'll be doing some side quests first. Who knows? Thank you very much for watching. This game is fucking awesome. This game is absolutely fantastic. I am loving every minute. I cannot wait to get back and play more. Hope you've enjoyed. If you have, please leave a like and subscribe and share the videos around if you can. I would really appreciate that. And I hope to see you back here for more next time. Thanks for watching.